Three, two, one. Hey there, and welcome back to another episode of This Guy's Thoughts. As usual, I, I do appreciate you swinging by and watching another uh, video. Uh, tonight's episode, I'm going to feature one out of uh, the Brew Kettle, out of uh, Middleburg Heights, Ohio. Get a look at their uh, their logo there. They're calling this, I guess it's called Kitka Chocolate Coconut Milk Stout. So one side of the can, you got the the uh, logo says Kitka. You got the 5.75% uh, alcohol by volume, 22 IBU listed right there. Uh, the other side of the can, you have the Kitka, this like tiger looking head, logo head. I'm not sure what that is. Um, and you have, it says uh, coconut, cho or chocolate coconut milk stout. So... Uh, their website says that uh, this has um, this milk stout has uh, let's see traditional milk stout with added milk sugar, cocoa powder, melted Belgian chocolate, and it's uh, let's see dry spiced with organic coconut flakes. So I'm really hoping for finally one that offers a nice uh, coconut um, flavor. And uh, I, I look for this to be kind of a sweeter side. Uh, obviously, it's a milk stout. Um, car, as far as the uh, artwork on this here, I uh, give it give it a uh, this is a four out of five. Um, ABV IBU listed. Uh, let's see here. It's got uh, decent coloring. Decent. I, I actually like the little logo there. So uh, I've never had anything from the brew kettle. Um, I've only actually seen a, a couple of them, honestly. Um, in my area and this one here the uh, chocolate um, coconut milk stout uh, just sound pretty good to me and I did pay uh, one dollar and ninety nine cents uh, for this here so dollar uh, ninety nine I don't think that's a bad price at all for what's in it and uh, we'll go ahead and crack this thing open and uh, see what it's all about here so definitely pouring out, uh, just holding it up to the light, watching it pour. It's like a really dark um, amber color in the pour here. I know it's coming across uh, very dark on camera here. So we got about a finger of uh, brown uh, head up on top of this. It's coming across very dark. Uh, in the glass, but as I was pouring it, there was a ambery, really super dark ambery tint to this thing. As far as aroma, oh wow, man, I am getting tons of chocolate and coconut. Man, this smells like a piece of candy, a piece of chocolate coconut candy. Just maybe, um, Maybe a, a toffiness to it, uh, if you're really digging for it. But it's a sweet-smelling chocolate, coconut, candy. Like a, uh, like a Mounds. Uh, little Mounds candy bars. One of my favorite types of candy bars. Um, absolutely love those things. This smells like that. Um, just a chocolate coconut um, candy. I mean, that that's pretty much it on the aroma here. So, uh, man, I'm really hoping for something great in this taste here. Uh, head's about gone there. Just a nice, uh, just, just a, a layer of uh, film laying on top of the, the glass here. So we'll go ahead and get a drink. This is probably the most coconut that I have ever tasted in a beer. It is, it's fantastic. It does taste like somebody took a milk stout, just melted down um, some coconut, some chocolate, just dumped it in here and mixed it up. Now, the type of chocolate. I 
I guess it's more of a cocoa, like a cocoa powdery chocolate. It's not a bitter chocolate. Sometimes you get that raw bitter chocolate. It's not that. As I'm processing the drink, it does, it's crazy that it does seem like I just ate like a, like a Mounds candy bar. Um, that's the aftertaste that I get here. This is really good. And I think for scoring this thing, uh, real quick on the scoring, uh, I'm going to give this about a, a 4.25 out of 5. This is rather enjoyable. Um, I'd probably drink this anytime it was available, honestly. It's actually, and I, and I don't, I haven't had a lot of milk stout. I've had a lot of milk stouts. I haven't reviewed a lot of milk stouts. This might be one of my favorite milk stouts. I just, I love the coconut. I love the cocoa. The whole chocolate vibe, everything about this is just great. Uh, Mouthfeel, excuse me. It's not quite full body, or I mean a medium bodied um, mouthfeel. Um, maybe on the uh, heavier side of, of a lighter bodied beer. Um, I mean, it, it, just, it doesn't even look thick in the glass here. But it does have a nice creamy sweetness to it, um, but a thin creamy, uh, if that makes any sense, kind of a, a thin creaminess to this. Coconut, chocolate, very sweet, um, very darn good. So if you've had this before, I'd be very, um, very curious to know what some of you guys out there might think about it if you've had this before. But to me, man, I'm all in on this thing. It is rather, rather tasty. So... Uh, anyhow, like, subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, check me out on social media. That's my thoughts.